Okay, and so you mentioned Charleston White. What's it been like to see him just become, like, arguably the biggest star coming out the city? So the first time we ever seen Charleston White, he was on the news. <laughs> snitching. Snitching. <laughs> going against Goyeo. Yeah. So, like I said, I was in Goyeo camp, so we like, so we all like, man, what the we ain't even, he wasn't even Charleston White at this time. Like he was Charleston White, but he wasn't the Charleston White that but we But he's know. on the news as like community activist. Yeah, he was yeah. just a regular pedestrian. And then <laughs> turned up on our ass. He, he turned into Charleston White. I mean, because L.A. kind of has that version of it, too, where there's a bunch of dudes who can be like, I remember when he was out here trying to be a crip and trying to hang out with all these, like, <laughs> gangster dudes and shit, And then all of a sudden he's like, you know, swearing death upon the yeah, Crips. Who? Charleston, because he's, you know, talking about how much he hates gang members. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Up, all this shit. Oh, yeah, now nah, he, yeah. Now nah, I Charleston White, though. That's my, that's unk, man. Right. That's unk. But now nah, we, when Charleston White first came out, everybody hated him. I sat there and watched everybody go from hating him to loving him because he, he, he like, he one of them guys you just gotta love because he, he say some real mm -hmm. shit. Like, whether you want to agree with him or not, he gonna say some real to get you on his side for sure. Yeah, it's weird. To, it's it's like hard to square the fact that he does say so much real shit and is so funny and so has such good observations. But then at the same time, he does sometimes say like the worst you ever heard in your entire right. life about wanting gang members to die, wanting rappers to die. Talking about Blueface's kid, he, how he'll place a bet that the kid's gonna die. <laughs> All and then you know even like the stuff talking about. Jewish and Asian babies and killing babies. All the, all he gonna this. say he gonna say whatever. But then he also will say he's talking about been white women. But then he'll say I was playing a character, right? Which is weird because that sounds like such. But then once you've actually watched the real him in interviews once, and stuff, you, you start to realize like I guess that is a character he because be bullshit. If you yeah. know Charleston White in real life, you will know man that nigga is the coolest nigga. <laughs> man, all that it's the shit he be saying. And he gonna stand on that shit too. He he gonna say that shit. And if you approach him in, in real life, he gonna stand on it. And he's gonna pepper but spray you. A lot of oh God, go pepper spray whatever he got in his arsenal. You kind of motivated me to get some pepper spray it, and a knife I'm and shit. You, I'm it's telling like, you. Let's be real. A lot of situations where you end up in a situation, you don't want to shoot the person. Yeah, you just want to get them off you. But you can always pepper spray the <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> you know? Charles is going to pull out that motherfucker pepper spray. Yeah, shooting nah, somebody sure. in the mall is like your whole life just is going to yeah. turn into chaos right. after that. But you could bust a pepper spray cl cl cloud and, and, and just get up out of there. Like yeah. that, <laughs> get up out of there. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, for sure. Now, I got a, uh, we, I'm on a, I'm on Charleston White's podcast now. I, I, they just added me as the. Uh, oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's it called? Game related. The game, game related, related podcast. Right. Okay. Know, yeah. yeah. Me, him, and Dewberry. Okay. Yep. Interesting. Um, all right. And so uh you said that he's the new Malcolm X. Mm-hmm. In what way exactly? Man, because he speak his mind. And he stand on and he stand on what he's talking about. And he's a community activist. That's the real Charleston White cares about the youth. Mm. He's trying to change. The youth, the the uh, he what Charleston White to tell you, I don't give a fuck about no grown nigga. I can't change no grown nigga. I give a fuck about the kids. Mm. He's trying to change the upcoming of you know what I'm saying. The next generation, right? He don't give a fuck about no grown up. Yeah. yeah. No. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that he says that seems really offensive at first, but when you really drill down into it, it's kind of like, obvious. damn, he was right. Yeah, I mean, like, all the <laughs> anti-street shit or all the anti-gang shit, it's like, well, it is kind of hard for me to sit here and, like, argue with you. Like, right. That, He's it's real. absolutely right. If you're a young kid and you decide to start hanging out with gangs and shit, it's probably not going to be a great decision for your life. Definitely. Yeah. He'd be absolutely right. So I, I agree with him 100% on that shit. We just hit 600,000 subscribers on the Clips channel right here. We're trying to get to 700, so you know what to do. Smack that red button and subscribe. Appreciate you.